Imagine a world where artificial intelligence doesn't just answer, it reasons, debates, and solves problems like a world-class expert. In 2025, two titans emerged to redefine the limits of machine intelligence, Grok 4, Elon Musk's ambitious and unapologetically raw creation under XAI, and ChatGPT5, OpenAI's meticulously refined, safety-first powerhouse. This isn't just a battle of software, it's a clash of ideologies. Bold innovation versus polished reliability. Grok 4 is known for its lightning-fast technical reasoning and fearless personality. ChatGPT 5 counters with unmatched accuracy, smoother integration into daily workflows, and a lower hallucination rate than any major model to date. Which one truly leads the AI race? Over the next 15 minutes, we'll dissect their strengths, weaknesses, and real-world performance across coding, knowledge, creativity, and more. By the end, you won't just know the winner, you'll know which AI belongs in your hands. The rise of Grok4 and ChatGPT5 has sparked one of the most fascinating debates in AI history. Both models are generational leaps forward, yet they embody two fundamentally different visions for the future of artificial intelligence. Grok4, launched in July 2025, is Musk's answer to the growing AI arms race. Developed by XAI, it's engineered for maximum capability, pushing boundaries in coding, math, and creative reasoning. It dominates technical leaderboards, such as Human Evil and AME, and is capable of nuanced problem solving that can outthink many prior generation models. But this raw power comes with trade-offs, a higher hallucination rate, around 4.8%, and a tendency toward provocative or controversial outputs. ChatGPT5, released in August 2025, represents OpenAI's commitment to safe, consistent, and widely accessible AI. Described as PhD level in reasoning, GPT-5 builds on GPT-4O's multimodal foundation, adding better long context handling, faster responses, and significant reductions in factual errors, down to roughly 1.4% hallucinations. It thrives in general knowledge tasks like MMLU and is deeply integrated into productivity platforms like Microsoft Copilot and Apple Intelligence. The key difference? Grok 4 is unapologetically adventurous, ideal for users who want maximum capability and don't mind navigating the occasional rough edge. ChatGPT5 is tuned for reliability, perfect for enterprises, educators, and anyone who needs high confidence answers at speed. In this showdown, we'll go far beyond marketing claims. You'll see benchmark data, real-world case studies, and user experiences side by side. We'll explore their architectures, performance profiles, and integration capabilities. And we'll weigh the ethical and economic factors that could decide the future of AI adoption. Paragraph 1, Grok 4 Deep Dive. When XAI unveiled Grok 4, in July 2025, the AI community quickly realized this was not just another incremental update, it was a bold leap forward. Building on the success and controversy of Grok 3, this model was engineered to be the most capable and unfiltered AI available to the public. At its core, Grok 4 uses a proprietary architecture optimized for reasoning depth and coding efficiency. It features a multi-expert routing system, allowing it to call specialized sub-models for math, logic, programming, and creative writing. This design gives it an edge in complex problem-solving, especially in STEM fields. In Human Evil Coding benchmarks, it scored significantly higher than GPT-4.0 and edged out GPT-5 in raw problem-solving speed. On the American Invitational Mathematics Examination AME, dataset, it demonstrated reasoning skills that rival human experts. Grok 4's personality is one of its most talked about traits. By default, it's configured with a more direct, occasionally sarcastic tone, a stark contrast to the diplomatic style of ChatGPT. This makes it engaging for certain audiences, particularly developers and tech enthusiasts who value candid, conversational AI. It's also less restricted in discussing sensitive topics, which Musk frames as a win for freedom of information, though critics warn it can lead to misinformation or harmful content if misused. 
One of Grok 4's most impressive feats is its performance in GPQA, graduate level physics, quantum, and advanced reasoning, where it outscored not just GPT-5, but also Google's Gemini Ultra in specific physics domains. In creative writing and brainstorming, Grok's risk-taking often leads to more unusual, inventive outputs compared to GPT-5's polished, but sometimes predictable style. However, Grok 4's weaknesses are notable. Independent evaluations found it hallucinated factual details roughly 3.5 times more often than ChatGPT-5. While it excels in niche, high-difficulty tasks, its general knowledge responses can occasionally veer off course. Its enterprise adoption is limited by its premium pricing model, reportedly as high as $300 a month for full, heavy access, making it less accessible for casual users or small businesses. In short, Grok 4 is like a high-performance sports car. Thrilling, capable and fast, but not necessarily built for everyone's daily commute. It's best suited for power users, researchers, and innovators who prioritize raw capability over polished predictability. Paragraph 2, ChatGPT, 5 Deep Dive. ChatGPT 5, launched in August 2025, is the culmination of years of iteration by OpenAI, focusing on balance, high reasoning power, low error rates, and broad accessibility. Architecturally, GPT-5 represents a refinement of the multimodal GPT-4.0 framework. It boasts a context window exceeding 1 million tokens, enabling it to process vast datasets, entire books, or lengthy code bases in a single session. Its ability to reason over such long contexts has revolutionized how researchers, analysts, and enterprises use AI for knowledge synthesis. Benchmark results show GPT-5 outperforming all previous OpenAI models in both general and domain-specific tasks. On the MMLU, Massive Multitask Language Understanding Benchmark, it scored marginally higher than Grok 4, showcasing superior breadth across humanities, business, and law topics. It trails Grok 4 slightly in math and physics reasoning, but makes up for it with better factual accuracy and consistency. One of GPT-5's standout achievements is its 1.4% hallucination rate, a record low among large-scale public models. This reliability has made it the default choice for mission-critical environments such as legal research, academic work, and corporate knowledge management. Combined with its smooth integration into Microsoft Copilot, Apple Intelligence, and third-party APIs, GPT-5 is already embedded in millions of workflows, its personality is highly adaptable, but defaults to a friendly, professional tone designed to avoid offense and maintain clarity. While some users find this safer style too conservative compared to Grok's bolder voice, it ensures a consistent user experience, an essential feature for enterprise clients. Pricing and accessibility are also strengths. GPT-5 is available via ChatGPT Plus at $20 a month for individual users, with enterprise packages offering enhanced data security, analytics, and model customization. This affordability, paired with reliability, makes it far more approachable for students, small businesses, and educators than Grok 4's premium tiers. Where GPT-5 truly excels is in multimodal reasoning, seamlessly interpreting images, audio, and text in the same conversation. This enables powerful use cases, from reviewing a legal contract alongside an image of a site plan to debugging code by reading screenshots. In essence, GPT-5 is the all-terrain vehicle of AI, less flashy than Grok 4 in niche performance, but more versatile, predictable, and ready for the masses. Paragraph 3. Head-to-head -head Performance and Benchmarks When the dust settles, benchmarks tell the most objective story, and the numbers reveal a fascinating rivalry. In coding, Grok 4 takes the crown. Human eval, it solved complex programming challenges 8% faster and with higher accuracy than GPT-5. It also beat GPT-5 in competitive programming datasets like CodeForces and LeetCode Hard Simulations. Developers who push AI for algorithm optimization, robotics control, or simulation scripting tend to report better outcomes with Grok 4. 
In mathematics, Grok 4 shines in abstract reasoning, particularly in competitions like AME and the AMC 12, where it not only produces correct answers, but explains them in a style reminiscent of human mathematicians. However, when it comes to general knowledge and reasoning breadth, GPT-5 edges ahead. On MMLU, GPT-5 outscored Grok 4 by 3%, with notable leads in law, history, and medicine. Its lower hallucination rate also makes it more trustworthy for professional fields where even minor inaccuracies can have major consequences. In science and advanced reasoning, results are mixed. On GPQA, Grok 4 outperformed GPT-5 in quantum mechanics and particle physics questions, but GPT-5 scored higher in biology, chemistry, and environmental science, making it the better all-rounder for scientific research outside hardcore physics. Creativity is a toss-up. Grok 4's less filtered style often leads to more daring and unconventional creative writing, which can be refreshing for content creators. GPT-5, on the other hand, produces more polished and audience-safe outputs, ideal for publishing without heavy editing. Speed also varies by task. Grok 4's architecture favors short-burst technical responses, sometimes completing tasks 10-15% faster than GPT-5 in coding or math queries. GPT-5 maintains steady response times even for ultra-long prompts, making it better for extended research projects. In real-world adoption, GPT-5's integrations give it the edge. Being directly accessible through Microsoft, Apple, and countless third-party tools means it's already the daily driver for millions. Grok 4, while powerful, remains more niche, favored in research labs, certain tech startups, and among hardcore AI enthusiasts. Overall, the head-to-head -head is less about one model crushing the other and more about specialization versus versatility. Grok 4 is the sharper scalpel in technical domains. GPT-5 is the Swiss army knife ready for anything. Paragraph 4, Ecosystem, Pricing, and Ethics. Beyond performance, the AI you choose will live in an ecosystem, and here, the differences are stark. Ecosystem. GPT-5's integration network is unparalleled. Its deep ties with Microsoft Suite and Apple Intelligence mean it can serve as your AI in email, documents, spreadsheets, presentations, and even system-level device interactions. Grok 4's ecosystem is still growing, with tight integration into X, formerly Twitter, and select XAI apps, but lacks the broad productivity footprint. Pricing, GPT-5 wins on accessibility. At 20 month for plus subscribers and competitive enterprise rates, it's a low barrier to entry. Grok 4's pricing, especially for the heavy variant at $300 month, targets high-value professional or institutional users, which limits casual adoption. Customization, Grok 4 offers more freedom in persona tuning and conversation boundaries. This flexibility appeals to advanced users and creative professionals who want AI without excessive guardrails. GPT-5 offers customization too, but within stricter safety limits. Ethics and safety, GPT-5 operates with a conservative safety net, actively avoiding potentially harmful, misleading, or biased outputs. This makes it attractive for regulated industries like finance, healthcare, and education. Grok 4's lighter safety layer can be empowering for free speech advocates, but risky for misinformation spread. Community and support, OpenAI benefits from a massive global user base, active developer forums, and extensive documentation. Grok 4's community is passionate but smaller, with Musk's X platform serving as the main hub for updates and discourse. In short, if you need reach, affordability, and professional polish, GPT-5 fits the bill. If you want freedom, peak technical power, and personality, Grok 4 delivers, if you can justify the price tag. When comparing Grok 4 and ChatGPT-5, it's tempting to declare one a definitive winner, but the truth is more nuanced. These models represent two complementary visions of AI's future, each excelling in areas where the other falls slightly behind. Grok 4 is the choice for specialists and innovators. Its technical reasoning, coding speed, and daring creativity make it a powerhouse for those pushing the boundaries of what AI can do. 
For researchers, engineers, and problem solvers in high-stakes technical domains, Grok 4 offers unmatched raw performance. ChatGPT 5 is the choice for the majority of users. Its balanced capabilities, reliability, and deep integration with mainstream tools make it ideal for professionals, students, and businesses. Its lower error rate and polished communication style ensure that it fits seamlessly into workflows without constant oversight. The competition between these two is good news for all of us. It pushes innovation forward, giving users more choice and driving each company to improve faster. Over time, we may see Grok adopt safer defaults and GPT-5 become bolder in creative spaces. Ultimately, your choice comes down to priorities. Do you value unfiltered exploration, maximum technical performance, and personality? Go Grok 4. Do you need a dependable, widely compatible AI for everyday tasks and professional contexts? Choose ChatGPT 5. In the end, this isn't just about picking a winner. It's about understanding which AI aligns with your goals today, while keeping an eye on how both will evolve tomorrow. And there you have it, the most in-depth, side-by-side look at Grok 4 and ChatGPT 5 you'll find anywhere. We've covered benchmarks, real-world performance, ecosystems, and the philosophies that drive these groundbreaking models. Whether you're leaning toward Grok's fearless intelligence or GPT 5's polished precision, remember, this AI race is far from over. The best part? You don't have to choose just one. Many power users are already running both, using Grok 4 for high-stakes technical or creative work and ChatGPT 5 for day-to-day -day reliability and productivity. That hybrid approach might be the smartest play until one model decisively outpaces the other. If you enjoyed this breakdown and want to stay ahead in the AI game, hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. We'll be diving into more head-to-head -head comparisons, deep technical analyses, and real-world AI case studies you won't want to miss. The AI world moves fast. Let's move faster together. See you in the next video.